All right, what's good YouTube? Nate with Mass Collector, and I have Hazel with me. Say hello, Hazel. Hello. And we are in our living room on the floor, and we have a new Eagle Moss build kit. And this one here is how your body works build. And what you do, you get these kits in, um, and you basically build a skeleton from the, the head down. And um, it looks really cool. So it's got, uh, here's your first issue that we got in. We got three different little magazines. Um, one's kind of the intro introductory The issue. eyes came out. <laughs> <laughs> yep, his eyes come out. The introductory uh, magazine, which kind of tells you about the build. Uh, this next one on how, what to expect when you put it together. And then this one here is basically your issue for this first section of the build, which kind of goes through, hey, try making a bone out of, you know, straws and glue and stuff to show kids how it works, how strong they can be, how your joints work, the world's biggest bones. Um, and uh, yeah, it looks pretty cool. Uh, lots of, uh, really great like learning tools in here that you can go through with your kids and so they can understand things a little bit more about the human body and bones and organs and stuff so you can actually buy the subscription um and just do the bone section of the of the skeleton um here's like build your own bones or you can keep the the subscription going and uh get the organs and even muscle tissue to go over the top of the stuff. So it gets pretty intricate. It stands about five foot six when it's all said and done. So it's a big uh, model. So this is the, the last page shows you your, uh, your first step on how to build your stuff, which we have here in the bag. <laughs> yep, so that's that. Um, Here's kind of the introductory issue here on what what to expect. So the all right, so the actual size of this is going to be 43 inches, 43 inches tall. So not five foot six, but I think I had five foot six on my brain because that's how big uh, this poster is. You get with it, so you get this huge poster too. I forgot, um, which has Billy Bones standing on his hands like that. Sometimes he stands on his feet. Yep. So this is the big poster you can hang up on the wall. And uh, it's kind of nice that they, they included in there. That's kind of like the life size of the guy. All right. Well, that's what we're going to build. Okay. So here's the, uh, or again, uh, back to the introductory issue. How your body works. It kind of goes through what you're going to get yourself into here. Um, the actual size. 43 inches tall. So, you know, almost a four foot tall uh, model, but as you can see, it kind of, I think it comes with a stand later that you get to assemble that you can, you can put them on. So he might actually stand a little bit taller at the end of the day. We'll see. Looks like it. Um, it says life size, complete skeleton and major organs, 43 inches tall. Um, you get a magnificent educational magazine with tips and illustrations and 3D illustrations, graphics, explanatory drawings, curiosities, experiments, and much more. So it <clears throat> looks really neat. Um, Daddy, I like how it says life, life size skeleton. And then you got a, you know, basically the size of a, probably a four year old, five year old kid. So, um, here's this page here. Amazing collection to help kids learn all about the mysteries of the human body. Complete model of Billy with his bones and organs on a stand. Um, when, when you get really into it, you can actually get other um, things, I believe, like his muscle yeah, tissue. So here's how we signed up for 
for everything. Um, you can cancel, you know, anytime or whatever. But we signed up for the whole, the organs and the muscle, the muscle tissue at least. I don't know about that. There was kind of sounds creepy, but a skin skin covering or not. But um, that's what it's gonna look like. Pretty exciting, actually. It's gonna be it's gonna be cool to uh, to do this and wanted to do something with Hazel that we could do once a month together for sure. And this looked like the perfect way to uh, do a video with her and also learn some stuff so um, on how the body works. So, so we get the uh, heart, lung, stomach, brain uh, all can be taken out. Exploring his insides help you understand how the human body functions. You get all the bones. So the collection cl consists of more than 40 pieces of skeleton that we put together. So obviously not every rib comes separate, things like that. Um, each issue, how to assemble it, it's really easy to do. Um, definitely have the kids in mind on this thing. Um, how the body works, a growing body, Bill uh, do and discover with all the different activities and stuff that comes with each issue. And uh, just got a lot of bit, a little, a little bit of everything here. This is really neat. It's not just, um, you know, stick. Here's the instructions. Do it. It's got explanations for everything to really help educate your kids on this stuff. So, uh, next magazine, we got these parts coming, which basically just fill in the rest of the head and start building the chest and the neck, and spine. So that's cool. And then uh, the last issue here. This one has. Um, all the instructions for shipments one through nine. So in the one big issue for you. So you can kind of go ahead and see what you're gonna get into. Um, lots of instructions here. Very good instructions, detailed, colorful, easy to follow. So, all right. Let's build. Let's build, okay. So how to build Billy. Um, when you're putting Billy together, you shouldn't need to force any of his pieces together too hard. If you're finding it tricky or don't understand something, ask a grown-up for help. If Billy bones break, sadly, they won't heal. So we're gonna make Billy's head. So what we're gonna do, can you grab the... You gotta take each tooth from its holder and slot it into one of Billy's two sockets. The teeth are numbered one to 16. Do them one at a time so you don't get confused about which tooth goes where. The numbers show where they, in the order in which they go. The set numbered from 1 to 16 with the arrow pointing downward go into the lower jaw and the set numbered from 1 to 16 with the arrow pointing upward go into the skull. Okay? Once you put in all of Billy's teeth, you can attach the jaw to the skull. All right, here, 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 here's a skull, here's a jaw, all right. I won't put the teeth on. Hang on, we gotta figure, we gotta pull all the teeth apart first. So it says, take each tooth from its holder and slot it into one of Billy's two sockets. The teeth are numbered one to 16, do them one at a time. So are you, we just gonna work with yours first? Up, down. So we want to put them in the in that piece first. So we want the top. So if you look at these, this thing here, this part here, it has an arrow that's pointing up, and it's got all the numbers. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, blah, 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 and it's got an order pointing up. So this is what goes into the skull. So that number with one arrow pointing downwards, the lower jaw. Number 116 with the arrow pointing up goes into the skull. So we're gonna put the jaw I know how to and those them. piece away. And then we're going to, if you look at the skull. I don't have to break the law. I'm, just, I'm guessing it goes one. Do we need, do we need to do, do we need to break the law? Yeah, honey, but this, hang on a second. 
So it looks like you start at the, I don't think it matters, but over here, so it ends up with the numbers 16 on his right side of the skull. So. Here, let me help you, honey. And you put them on, and I put them in. So, yeah, we want to make sure that we. The number we got, we got number one. Okay, so here's number one. And then you're going to want to stick it into this hole. Get it? And look at that. There we go. Right in there. So. I get start. You get it started and I'll pull it off. Okay. All right. And it goes into the hole next to that one. Job one two. Let's see. Make sure we're putting them in right. Right. Yeah, the valley goes like that. Yeah. No, I can. I can get started. Okay. Got a GoPro on a tripod, so that's our filming. I'll feed them to you. Next one. Goes in number three. Make sure you keep your head up, honey, so you can get, there you go. Get it? Let's see, I don't want to push too hard because there we go. Here's number four. help you out. We don't want to push too hard honey because we want to make sure that we put them in in the right way and don't force it because remember Billy's bones don't heal. Okay here's the next one. Started, I can finish it up, and push it in like teamwork, right? I think it goes in this one. There we go. I think we got to make sure we get like this. There's a groove, obviously, in the tooth. Uh, I don't know if there's a front versus the back or. Can eat too. You think so? All right. So now this one here, we got to put the uh, the long spot on the outside. Maybe right like this. Yep. Like this. Yep. You got it. Good job. Here's the next one. This one goes like that. Like that. Yep. Like the that. long part on the outside. Right like that. I'm doing it. Alright. There. Jeff, this one goes next to that. We're almost done. And Hazel, how old are you? Four. Four. Just turned four a few months ago. Here's your old next one. No. You got it. That's done yet. Yeah, you got it. Good job. See? It doesn't go all the way like that. That's your end. As far as it goes. Next one. Remember, it doesn't have to go all the way in, honey. You don't want to force it, okay? Can you help me? Yep. Make sure you, you know, I need your help sometimes, and sometimes you'll need my help, so. Okay? No. It's okay, we're doing it together. Teamwork. All right, next one. 
I don't want to do the next one. They're too hard. You do the rest for me. You want me to do the rest? Yeah, I'm going to cook the Okay. <laughs> All right, so doing Billy. What the? Oh, I've got the wrong tooth here. There we go. Got them mixed up. Almost done, honey. We got the whole, we got the bottom jaw to do yet too, kiddo. That thing goes here. Okay, so there we go. Um, got the teeth in the top. That. They're in there pretty good. You know, Dion doesn't, you can pull them out easily, but they're in there pretty well. So that's cool. Got the uh, the top done. Now we're going to put the teeth into the, the jaw. So here's the bottom, obviously. No, got the bottom teeth to do now. There's two. You gonna come help me, please? Hazel's kind of lost interest already. I think when there's a lot of repetition on some things, she kind of just loses interest quickly. I think once we get into the, some of the, the other stages, it'll hopefully grab her attention more, not as repetitive. Again, I don't know if there's a front side or a back side or what on these teeth when it comes to these, but just trying to make it look like it, you know, best eye appeal. Why don't you come here and help me finish this? I don't want to finish this. It's long. Taking too long? Well, not everything happens quickly. I'll finish this part. I don't like chewing the teeth. You don't like doing the teeth? I don't. Why? I don't like doing it. Yeah, but that's not a that's not a reason. That's just saying that you don't want to. Why don't you like it? What what about it is that on here that you don't like? <laughs> well, now that your legs are now falling asleep, do you want to help me finish it? Because if you had an actual reason why you didn't like it besides your legs are falling asleep, we could document it here and then, you know, other people will know what to expect when they start to put it together with their kids. That's the whole point of this. See if you like it or not. You don't have to like it. I like it. Well, I just don't want to do the teeth. Okay. That's that's a good answer. She doesn't want to do the teeth. Because they're too small? Yeah. How do you, yeah. 
I got bait. It's kind of got a flashing here on it. Kind of prickly. And here is the last one. All right, so we got the teeth in to the jaw. So there's the teeth. Okay. And here's the skull. And to do this, you just kind of notch it into the head here. Push the bump on the lower jaw A into the slot on the side of the jaw skull B. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh, I just lost a tooth. There we go. Just kind of slot snaps snaps in there. We lost a tooth on top here. We'll stick that back on. All right. So there we go. We have the teeth on and the jaws on. So it kind of doesn't stay up, but it moves around a little bit. It's pretty cool. Quick little 20 minute or less activity for the step one. And uh, I'm sure we'll get the next issues here in about a month. And we'll do another video and uh, complete the head. So his Don't brains come. his brains come next. Don't take this off. Don't take this on. Don't take this off the floor because I Hang like on, that. we're almost done with the video. Okay, how do you think? How do you think it turned out? Good. Okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> are you a nice skeleton? Yes. What's what are we gonna name him? Mm. His name is Billy. You like Billy? Yeah. Billy Bones. So that's Billy Bones. Step one. Uh, the next one we get the brain and the spine and things like that, I believe, in the next episode. We get uh, spine and ribs. We find out about the skull, spine, ribs, arms, and legs, and movements and stuff. And then we build more pieces. We're gonna get the top of Billy's skull, which is the cranium, his eyes, brain, cerebellum, right long spine. Daddy. What? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, there will be a heart coming at some point too. Thank you. So. Um, clip and assemble plugs, clip, neck clip and assembly plugs and neck shipment as well. See how your skull keeps your brain and eyes safe. So we'll see you soon. Get it? See the eyeballs. But thanks for checking it out. Please subscribe. We'll uh, start a playlist with how your body works. Build from Eagle Moss. So if you want to check in new episodes, you can when we when we put them out. So. Appreciate it, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Say bye, Hazel.